Alright, so I'm going to do a quick video here on how to make a bit.ly shortcut for a URL. The first thing you need to do is go to bit.ly.com, B-I-T-L-Y.com, and you can do it without an account, but it's best to have one. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in using my email. Uh, as you can see, you can use Facebook or Twitter, um, so it's up to you. The reason why a bit.ly is a good idea is because uh, this URL would be extremely difficult to remember uh, for a student. Of course, you could save it in your favorites, but I think a bit.ly is cool. So what we will do is copy this, and we will go over to the bit.ly website, and right here, we are going to paste it. Okay, so uh, here it is. It gives us this... Um, option here. Now since we have an account, we don't have to accept this, but we can edit it and make it our own. So we'll delete this and I'll try calling it Showcase. Um, sometimes you got to uh, try a few different ones. Um, here's what we'll do. We'll try this Showcase. And see if it works for us. No showcase. Uh, so we call it student showcase. Okay, that one's already taken. So sometimes you have to try a couple times. How about S showcase? The showcase. It really doesn't like any of these. Showcase all. Okay. Showcase all it is. So, there you go. So, what we can do now is if we want to go to the student showcase, we could just have this URL and then you can paste that up here, and you'll see it will go to the student showcase. Cool tool.